Guys, what's up? Tyler Brown Vloggers here with another video, and today I'm gonna do an unboxing. And today I'm gonna show you my frame. Uh, and yeah, let's get right into it. I got a, I ordered a sprocket from Caught. Um, so Caught Crew sent me a sprocket that I ordered, and I got here early. It was supposed to be tomorrow, but it got to here today, and we're gonna strap chest mount on and do the unboxing with the chest mount. I think it will look pretty cool. So let's get right into it. Hey guys. I'm currently sitting on my new frame. I'll tell you guys about this in a minute. And here's the package. I cannot flip it over because all my information is on the other side. Hopefully I can open this with my hands, which I don't know if I'll be able to. Alright guys, I got something to open up the package with. So, here we go. Let's see if I can just reach this. Yeah, there we go. Wow, they sent me a bunch of black cult stickers. I asked for black cult stickers and they sent me some. Oh, they sent me a white one too. That's cool. I got three black ones and two white ones. Thank you, cult. I love these stickers. These are like decals. You uh, peel them off like the one I had on my black cult frame. These are just stickers. But they'll do. DJ, I got you some. <laughs> So yeah, here is my sprocket. I got the Cult Member V2 sprocket in black, 25.2. Let's open this bad boy up. I love this sprocket. I love the design. I look. I love how thick it is. Look at that. Hold on. Yep, and there's what I've seen on uh, another unboxing. There is um, a white Cult sticker. Put that back in the bag. And uh, two different sp adapters, spacers, uh, for s different sizes. So yeah, this is a sick sprocket. Look, look at that. Look how thick that is. This is why I got it because it's so thick, and it the design is just. This is just like a dream sprocket from right here. It's 3D etched logo or something. Like that, it said. Yeah, this is really nice. as a little cult. Let me see if I can get that in there. Let's see if you can see cult right there. There it is. You can kind of see it. So yeah, guys, this is a sick sprocket. I love it right now <laughs> um so thanks cult for all the stickers and stuff i love cult cult is my favorite brand if you guys are wondering what my favorite bmx brand was it is cult because i like their parts and i've never broken any of their parts before and the whole the whole cult team is some of my favorite riders like trey jones is my favorite rider other than scotty kramer um their whole team kills it all right guys um, this is my new frame. Well, it's not new. It's used. I um, pretty much got this for a steal, but I got it for a good price. Um, actually, DJ, hold on. Alright, the AC unit kicked on while well, I was trying to record. So, I uh, hope you guys can hear me a little bit better. But, um, yeah, I got this for a steal. It came with the frame. It came with bars, a stem, and black cranks, and... A seat, a pivotal seat post, and a pivotal seat. Um, DJ, I'll let DJ have the seat, the seat post, uh, and the bars, but he still has to give me the stem. I have the cranks, but they're black, they're spray painted. Um, and I got them in there just in case if these break or something, or if I want to ride black cranks, I can put them on there. So, yeah, this is a We the People Reason frame. It is stamped. We the People under there. I don't know if you guys would be able to see that, but it's stamped. And um, it's it's a I think it's a raw. I looked up on the site. It, they had it in raw. So this is like a raw silver kind of thing. Um, it's really sick. I like it. 
Um, the reason I got this frame is not because my other frame broke or anything. It was just stamped. I know that this frame is stamped. It's 100% full chromoly. It has the same exact di dimensions that I've been wanting for a while. I don't know why I'm shaking the camera while I said that, but... <laughs> yeah. And I still have to get my chain on because I built the bike up Saturday and we was going to go get the chain put on Sunday, but I forgot KNG was closed and I don't have a chain breaker, so... That's why that's off. And this weekend... Uh, let's see, I think tomorrow actually we're going to ride. Today was my last day of school. I didn't go today because I didn't have to. So I just stayed home. <laughs> you know, everybody probably did that today, but yeah. So We the People Reason Frame. It's a very nice frame and it's starting in rain right now, so I gotta hurry this up. So yeah, top tube is 20.75. Uh, the head tube is 75 degree, I think. Um, the dropouts are 13.5. The seat tube is 71 or something like that. Um, yeah, it's sick. I love it. It's a very nice frame. And w one reason why I got a new sprocket is because this sprocket is bent. <laughs> Let me show you this. I don't know if you guys can like see that or not. I don't know if you guys can see that, but in real life, if you had just spun mine cranks, you could see that it's bent. And yeah, guys, I really love this frame. Shout out to DJ for getting me this frame. This frame actually has... I forget what they call this right here, but it has the round, damn, I can't think of it, I'll say round dropout thingy, whatever, <laughs> can't think of it, I had it earlier, I had the name of it earlier, but it has a round one on my old frame, and this frame, it just has a straight one, so I really like this frame, about that, I really like them both, I don't know, I haven't really rode that one yet to say I like it enough better than this one, but, I don't know, another thing I like about this frame more than that frame is, Right here, it's not just straight like mine, like smooth. This has the bearing, like, I don't know, like engravement where the bearing sits. And it also has them right here on the head tube. Another thing that I like about this frame that my other frame don't have is an ovalized down tube. Now most of you guys might be thinking like, why, is, why in the hell is it oval in this frame? I mean, when? It's crazy. I think... The ovalized down tube on some other frames are for like dent protection or something. Don't mark me on that, but I'm pretty sure that's what it's for. And yeah, so I don't know if I'm downgrading or upgrading. I don't know if this frame is 100% full chromoly. It's not stamped anywhere. Like, the person I got it from said it was a Call OS, but all the other Call OS frames I've seen and all the other cult frames I've seen have engraved engravement in them like a caulk badge um that was removable brake mounts and stuff it's a good frame but yeah here's my shadow interlock chain i still have to get this put on swap to that bike um shout out to at risk again and caulk crew um so yeah that's pretty much that frame i'm still, still gonna keep it for a backup but i really love this frame it's sick Alright guys, I did like a little montage of me building that. I have a whole bunch of mess. This thing is perfectly straight. Um, let me see if I can... Yeah, it's straight. And I got the Galaxy Vans on today. So yeah, I love this rocket. Uh, I can't wait to ride it and get my chain on. But yeah, th here it is. Try to get some angles. So, Alright guys, thank you for watching the video. 
If you have any comments on the frame of the sprocket or any of my bike parts, leave it down in the comment section below. I will get back to you as quick as I can. Um, so yeah, guys, thank you for watching again, and subscribe if you want, like if you want, dislike if you want. If I need to do better editing my videos, tell me and I will. Tell me how the videos are doing, if you would, if you have any time. So yeah, guys, until next time. Thanks for watching the videos and peace. Yeah, I love this view. Penthouse, we stainless. This the life I choose. All these ladies.